hello beautiful people what's up guys welcome to my channel this is your girl mommy so true guys i am checking in to all of my thrivers and survivors out there my warrior gang those of you who know what a narcissist is and if you don't know what a narcissist is let me tell you what a narcissist is in just one sentence a narcissist is a big fake phony deceptive coward a big phony deceptive coward somebody might want to throw the word clown in there too because that literally describes what a narcissist is we're not talking about how they became a narcissist we're talking about what a narcissist is today i want to take a moment to talk to you about how a narcissist will be the biggest coward you will ever know in your life narcissists are cowardly people y'all if you pay attention to the the tactics and the tools that they use to entrap people in their prison it's confirmation that they're cowards to have to lie and deceive somebody to even be in your life is confirmation that you are a coward and then to pull this person in this person who is full of value, smart as hell, full of resilience because they've been through hell in their life and they know how to fight through life. The ultimate warrior for a narcissist to pull you into their world and then try to devalue you and strip you naked from what you are. Tell you you're not good enough. Tell you you don't carry any value. This is a coward. This is a coward for the simple fact that they're intimidated by everything that you brought to the table. They're intimidated by everything that you really are on the inside. To your core, to your core, you are a fighter. To your core, you're a warrior. To your core, you are a thriver in life. Your life has never been easy, but you make it look very easy. You intimidate a narcissist. You intimidate a narcissist because there is no way somebody like you should be standing as tall and as beautiful and as handsome as you still stand. And because this person is a narc, they're jealous of that light. Because they don't have no sense of direction where they're going in their life, what they're doing with their life. They hate the fact that you have a vision for yours you've always had it you've always carried a vision a determination and it's to be hated it's to be hated by people who do not carry that type of resilience value that type of intelligence so a narcissist ends up becoming the biggest coward you will ever know in your life because they are too busy hating on you too busy trying to compare you to unnecessary people and unnecessary things such a coward that they know they don't deserve you but they'll hang around they'll hang around in an attempt to ruin you so nobody else can have you such a coward that instead of saying you know what you are too good for me you you are wifey material you are a husband maybe i need to just walk away because i know that i bring turmoil into your life instead of doing that a narcissist will stick around and make sure that they can do whatever they can to pull you down at whatever cost because they are a coward this coward knows you can do better by yourself with someone else but they're such a coward that they would rather sit on your life that's why it's been 10 years 15 20 25 with this narcissist because the coward knows that if they were to let you go you will go and discover that they actually was not on your level you will go and see that there's actually well-equipped men and women out here 
you will go and find out that other people have real moms and dads in their life and what you called a parent it ain't that Narcissists are the biggest cowards that any real one will ever encounter in their life. They run from the truth and you are the truth. You're a truth seeker and a truth seer. And a narcissist cannot stand either of those. Not the person who is seeking the truth, the person asking questions, wanting to know because you're trying to figure them out. And not the person who is speaking on the truth. Because that means you're exposing. That means you're you're talking about who they really are. That means you've seen and figured out that there's a mask. And behind that mask is a whole childish ass clown. A broken ass baby. And for the simple fact that everything is everybody else's fault but theirs, this makes them a coward. Narcissists don't take accountability, cannot, don't want to. That makes them cowards. Because you got a grown man and a grown woman running away from their responsibilities. Running away from being mature enough to co-parent without you having to bring legal things in to, to, to make sure that things don't go crazy. The biggest coward you will ever know because you can't even raise a child with them without there being issues. It's tit for tat even in parenting. It's tit for tat even in situations where you have a narc who doesn't even have an educational background but is telling you the one with education how much value you don't have. Don't let the situation turn around and you start glowing, you start thriving, you start elevating in life because you refuse to let them keep you from doing that. Then they start to notice that your light is still shining, it's still there. That coward is either going to act like they wanna beg you and keep you in the relationship or that coward is going to find a back burner supply to run off to because once you abandon them, they're back to that little ass baby that they are. There's more trauma that they're going to bring into somebody else's world because now you've taken your power back. You've noticed there's a mask. You've walked away. You've chosen to elevate. You've chosen to, you know, focus on your, your, your values because they're there. Taking your power back. One of the things that I want people to really understand when you're talking about how powerless the narcissist is, what is a narcissist? We're talking about a coward because they lack courage. They lack courage. They can't endure anything unpleasant that comes with life because life is not always, you know, fruit. And, and sugar and candy and money sometimes things happen sometimes stuff happens and a narcissist breaks so fast they don't know how to handle pressure they don't know how to handle real life problems they crumble they run like a freaking chicken they are weak like mouse Okay, a mouse is one of the most cowardly little animals in the world. Every little sound, you know, just easily intimidated like a mouse. That's a damn narcissist. A major coward. A major coward. This is the biggest coward you're going to ever know. Not only do they fear honesty, not only do they not take accountability, not only do they lie and avoid the truth. But they avoid strong people like you. A narcissist is hating you, treating you bad because you're strong as hell and they cannot stand you. The narcissist discards because you're strong and they cannot handle you. They avoid strong people. This is a narcissist. Major coward alert. 
major coward alert. They're only devaluing you because you're strong as hell. Listen to what they're devaluing. Everything they're devaluing is actually a lie. Calling you stupid when you're smart as hell. They didn't even go to high school. <laughs> Come on, coward. Come on, coward. What makes a narcissist the biggest coward you'll ever know is the fact that they pretend that they don't know they got a problem. Yeah, I said it. Because a lot of them are pretending that they don't know they got a problem. You don't have to know that you are a narcissist to know that you are a fucked up person. To know that every relationship has been a vicious, toxic cycle because you feel so entitled all the time. Because just because you're paying bills, somebody needs to kiss and wipe your ass. That, to me, makes you an extremely monstrous coward. You're always taking the easy way out. You are a coward. That is a narcissist. You cannot be decisive. You don't know how to be truthful, honest. You don't know how to handle nothing maturely. So you'll find the easy way out. It's easier to groom some new dumbass supply than to stick around and work on my marriage. I rather dump this relationship and never marry a real one because it'll be easier to settle for someone who's more like me. Easy, low value, cowardly, <laughs> taking, the, taking the easy way out. Taking the easy way out. This is why they're magnets for weakness. Narcissists are always in situations that make them look weak. Always. Look at all of you watching these videos. Every single one of you that have a story about what you went through with a narcissist makes that narcissistic man or woman weak as hell because I can't believe some of the things that I hear, some of the comments that I've read, I'm like, wow, you were dealing with a weak ass man. You were dealing with a weak ass woman, AKA a major coward, worried about image when there's nothing, when there's nothing to freaking look at. There's nothing to look at. You, you don't have nothing worth looking at. All you care about is manipulating, which makes you the, the most monstrous coward when you have to manipulate people to get what you want or to get your way or to get someone in your life. You have to manipulate for someone to love you. You're a coward. And towards the end of the relationship and even during the relationship, the fact that you never get a thank you, I'm sorry, you are a coward. They are a coward. They'll criticize you. They'll make lies up about you. They will put things on you. They will send you to the store for shit they don't even need just to work you. Just to get you out the house so that they can narc somebody else. It's just constant trash that you're taking out dealing with a narcissist and they don't ever apologize there's never no thank you for for helping them and digging them out of the holes that they are always in because they have no balance in their life they have no balance in their life so cowardly all they do is guilt trip bait you have pity stories <laughs> and and thrive in arguments the biggest coward you will ever know is a narcissist. <laughs> Massive drama queens. The biggest coward you will ever know. It's easier to try to argue with you. You might ask one question. Better yet, you might make one valid statement. That narcissist is going to just snap, lose their whole mind because they cannot handle the fact that you just called them out. The fact that you just said something truthful. The fact that you just made them have to face who they really are. Major coward alert. And if you don't know that that's what you're dealing with, hopefully this video educates you and enlightens you to pack up 
come up with a plan and run for your life because this is a coward. And all they're gonna do is have you wasting your energy, burning yourself out, trying to prove how much you're not the coward. <laughs> don't do it. Don't waste your breath, don't waste your time, don't waste your energy. It's not worth it. You're dealing with a coward. Take your power, walk away, and stay away. They're a coward. They're never going to give you closure. They're never going to apologize. They're never going to say thank you. They're going to move on and act like they don't care about you. They never did. They never loved you. Matter of fact, it's your fault. You wanted this relationship because they are a coward. Even though they laid there and, and, and influenced you to have a child with them, got you to marry them, got you to pay for things. <laughs> it's okay. Swallow that pill of hurt and pain and move on because you've dealt with a coward. They don't like you because you're strong and they're cowards. They're smearing your name because you got it going on and they're cowards. <laughs> my greatest discovery of what a narcissist was or what a narcissist is and I had to put a stamp on it matter of fact put a period at the end the ultimate coward the biggest coward I've ever known from parents all the way down to a spouse friendships and all they like silent treatment they like punishing you with discards and stuff like that because they are cowards they really can't face you. They really can't face anybody. They Hell, they can't even face their self, not their real self. Cowards. Only a coward has to wear a mask and fool everybody. There's nothing stand up about the narcissist. Fake as hell because they are cowards. And it just is what it is. Just here to show the, share the truth, enlighten you with education and empowerment so that you can take your power back and stay there and never turn around look back none of that just move forward and thrive forward and just be your best self know that you escaped the prison of cowards they wanted to trap you and make you into one of them they wanted to strip you of the character that you have because they're jealous of it cowards complete cowards I pray that this helps someone. I thank you for watching it. Thank you for taking a moment to listen to me on today. Keep thriving, warriors. Until next time, guys, stay blessed.